West Bengal Chief Minister Buddhadev Bhattacharya emerged from weeks of silence to put to rest the controversy over land for IT majors, Wipro and Infosys. The government may have scrapped the IT hub, but the Chief Minister offered them 45 acres each at Rajarhat and he said the price was negotiable. Munideepa Banerjee reports. After almost going underground for a month, apparently because of ill health, Buddhadev Bhattacharya took charge today of the imbroglio over land for Infosys and Wipro and issued a public invitation to the two IT giants to come and invest at Rajarhat Township near the Kolkata airport. Just last week, the IT hub near Vedic village, where the two companies were to get 90 acres each, was scrapped because of allegations of illegal purchase of land by private parties. We are ready to give 45 acres of land each to Wipro and Infosys. 45 acres. And they will, uh, they can come and immediately take possession of the land and they can start constructing their new center in Dajanath. Today's was the first press conference Buddhadev Bharacharya has addressed after the left debacle in West Bengal in the Lok Sabha elections. In fact, since August, Buddhadev had kept a low profile, skipping a meeting with the Prime Minister, avoiding Ratan Tata and giving a Politburo meeting in Delhi the miss. But today he took the Vedic village land scam by the horns. But you know, something unfortunate happened in uh, that Vedic village area. Not only unfortunate, some criminal activities took place. We had no idea that this group is operating through musclemen and they are using weapons and all that and torturing people and thereby <coughs> capturing land also. Therefore, we thought it is not morally correct for government to take over that land at, it, at this stage. The only uncertain element is the price of land. Buddhadev says it is negotiable. Party sources say it is a relief to have Buddhadev once again take charge. Ill health had apparently spurred the West Bengal Chief Minister to keep a somewhat low profile the last month or so. But the Wipro and Infosys crisis seems to have spurred him back to business. In Kolkata, Monideepa Banerjee, NDTV.